Wagner, Justin Edwards, Ron Holland, Sean Stewart for Team USA, Andre Stoyan. Up and down the court on us. And here's Bronny James checking into the game. We know he can shoot from outside. All eyes on Bronny James and his dad, LeBron James. Who's again, how proud of A sophomore, National Player of the Year, regardless of class. So you understand what he's saying. Like. Yeah, just I'm super proud of all my kids. You know, Carmine, Cameron, Caden as well. Uh, both of those sophomore twins won the national I championship. I played also Yoli Stewart yeah. in Cleveland. So just to see all these kids have spotlights on them, they take on that every day. They live in a different, different landscape with their social media and so many platforms and like NBA level coverage. And they're in high school, so it, for them to they have, have a higher draft pick to continue to grow the, the game on the collegiate level. No, it's a great conversation to have. You think about guys that are in college now. And this is Jerry Mahane with the hope. Team USA up 11 to 4. Contact right in front of us. You see the world team trying to pick up full court now to add some pressure to the USA team. One point game, and they were down by as much as six. Over. Team World could take their first lead. Staggering defense by Team USA, forcing a turnover. Ronnie James on the break. Oh. Job right there, shielding him with his body, using the shoulder, getting into the defense. Soft on the glass. You mentioned a soft touch, the most impressive part of his game. Blake Buchanan checking in the game for Team USA, headed to UVA next season. Talk about Ronnie being undeclared, Will. Portland. Oregon crowd goes wild for Jackson Shilstead, a local product, and then Bronny James, the steal, and the seven, quickly. Another steal. Caliente, a 10-point lead. Bronny Shilstead, loving it. Seven steals for Team USA. Buckets after the bucket, did a good job of sharing the ball, knocking down shots. Fun to watch. I mean, you talk about the plus minus on the collegiate level, you think about the impact of a player when they come on the floor, who gets better. This team went three seats left on the floor, you got the crowd behind you, everyone cheering for him, the hometown kid. But I like the fact that we have not even seen the world team get the ball across half court. Like, it starts on the defense. Coach Steve Turner for Team USA was saying, hey, we want what happened in a McDonald's or an an all-star game, an exhibition game. That's what we want. We don't want a game where guys are just out here having fun. And you see that from the onset, what's happening right now. 9-0 run from Team USA, and it has been all defense leading to the right here. It's Tuesday and Wednesday. They've been practicing all week getting ready for this game. Risha say on the floor. USA across your chest or the world team across your chest. They go on this the loose ball right here. Risha say dives for you. See Jerry McCain come out of nowhere. Goes for the well. There he is showing off what he can do on offense. Yeah, we talked about him being a supreme athlete. You see him going above the rim and getting up there and then finishing the home right here. As Team USA he takes it to even bigger lead as they go up by 12. Buchanan with the block. That's his calling card. Wagner, just a bit left. Tough take. Shot clock off. Minimum coming at that time, but they could have held for the last shot of this quarter. Holloway takes the last shot. Oh! And by what do you make of that evaluation when you see those numbers? I think it's incredible. And obviously, Bronny James has the biggest name right now. The and biggest she's from the Rock Nation. She Ooh. can also spit that fire on the mic as well. Yes, so this is, I mean, with this game, it's it's, it's not You're just to impact you on how you need to spend that money. And I know a few dads over here as well with 3D understanding the importance of that. Right. I think the biggest thing too far for these kids, men and women, is your image off the floor, Absolutely. off the court, how you carry yourself, how you dress, all those types of. Great game between these two teams. A 
two-point advantage for Team USA. Ronnie James shot the air ball last time out. Back-to-back -back air ball. Very on the corner. They've had to learn how to play together through the scrimmages. So they've been able, they've had two days, they scrimmage against one another, and you can see it. Holloway loses it. Ronnie James with the steal. He's pushing the pace. McCain. Great pass to Edwards. There you go. Ronnie, ball fake. Gets the look, but can't get it. Plus minus. I was like, what are you talking about? I'm like, what, how many points do we have? What's going on? But it is important when you can see your impact in plus 14. You're doing all the other things right. You may not be scoring, but your team is trending in the right direction, whether it be an assist, whether it be how they were able to steal. They had like four consecutive steals. At what point does... Team World with the opportunity to take the lead. Good defense by Not saying he can't take that shot, but there are better shots. So when you're forcing people to take shots they're not really comfortable with, that's a Actually, plus. Team USA is Jared McCain gets a left-hand layup. We'll likely get two possessions here, 30 seconds to go. Ooh. A block on the block. Gas, just kind of fill the game out. Now, I don't think it should be waiting that long in order to do so, but the fact that he can just really score in a... In he a threw it and played in the throne. Just an amazing kid that loves to win. Yeah, I mean, that was an NBA schedule. You know, he, he played the game in Houston, was co-MVP with Isaiah Collier. His team actually won the, the ball. And it's all been in the, at the beginning of the fourth quarter. Wagner, in and out. Holloway is fouled. A big reason this one has remained close. Shea. Too short. Ronnie on the attack. Gets the open look. Cash. So really good knockdown three-point shooter, as well as a terrific defender. Holloway and Ronnie forces the turnover. What we is in clutch situations. He's been able to step up the Sonny McDonald's All-American game. We're seeing it now here at the Nike game section. A clutch is like when you want the ball to well, make winning. What does that look like to get the ball out of his hands? McCain to James. Nice. Great cut right there. The guard play of Team USA is for Team World. They absolutely need a stop. They are in a 2-3 zone. Team USA has been struggling to shoot from outside. Ronnie James. Cannot connect. Don't like giving the losing teams a second chance to make the play. Oh, it shouldn't be for, for eight. It shouldn't be seven. <laughs> I agree with that one too. Right, right, right. But I mean, obviously, Ball. it's, Ball. it's, it's 17 seconds to go. Stojakovic from the corner is blocked. Oh, Little is blocked. Another block by Buchanan. Three in a row. Holloway for three. Oh. Roddy James gets the rebound and is fouled and will head to the charity strike with five seconds to go and his team up by four. The opportunity to ice it. Plus 14 on the floor. Run. Stop. Ooh, great job protecting the basket right there. They get the big rebound. You see this miss right here. Ronnie James goes up and snags it, gets fouled. Now he's going to the free throw line. Great job by Team USA protecting the basket. So there's starters and there's finishers. Ronnie James didn't start this game, but he's finishing. That's a great point. Absolutely. Ice water in the vein. Free throw line. I think that's what 3D was asking, too, for the coaches. He's like, I don't really care about who's starting the game. Who finishes for you because the trust factor has to be there. Ronnie James, the sixth Team USA player in double figures. He now has 11. And with five seconds to go, he puts his team up by six. Opportunities at the end. And the players that stepped up, I think mostly defensive plays on both ends. Yeah, that's what I'm most impressed with. That's also what college coaches and the NBA scouts that are here want to see. They want to see you compete on both sides of the ball. Are you making winning plays all over the court? And these, okay. and these guys are doing... Underneath the basket. 
Johnson, defended by Bronny, kicks it out to Stojakovic. He's off, and that is your ball game. Team USA wins 90 to 84. How exciting is it when we can see this game? We're going back to the women's game, the inaugural game for the Nike Hoop Summit, but then also just seeing the brightest players and where the future of this game continues to be. I mean, at the end of the day, there's one. Seeing Ronnie James and Team USA win, Bruce? Absolutely, man. It's just, I think it's all the dads here. Obviously, Bronny's here, DJ's here.